Low, by Charles Hoyfort, Part 1, Chapter 5 I, just how effective, as an inquiry stopper, was the story of the girl and the small quantity, is shown by the way the Society for Psychical Research was influenced by it. See Journal of the Society for Psychical Research, October, 1919. Mr. Guy's letter to the Times is taken as final. No knowledge of conflicting statements by him is shown. The Society did not investigate. A small quantity can be explained as it should be explained, but barrels of it must be forgotten. Case dismissed. If the Reverend Hugh Guy described at one time a downpour which had driven out him and his tables, chairs, beds, rugs, all those things that I think of seriously, because I have recently done some moving myself, and then told of a small quantity, why have I not an explanation of this contradiction? I wrote to Mr. Guy, asking him to explain, having the letter registered for the sake of the record. I have received no answer. In the London Daily Mail, September 3rd, 1919, are reproduced two photographs of oil dripping from different ceilings. Large drops of oil are clearly visible.